Marhaba friends, would you like to install Wine 6.0 on your Linux system? Yes, Wine 6.0 has been released on January 14, 2021 and it's not available on the system for, for by default even if you update through sudo apt or any yum, you, you will not get it. To check the version of Wine on my system, yeah, I do not have any Wine. So even if I install through sudo apt, I will just get Wine uh, version 5.0. So, or I will get Wine Development 5.5, but Wine 6.0 has been released and I want to update it because I want to run the latest and greatest Windows apps on my <laughs> Linux machine. So, browsing to the site, you will see announcement Wine team is proud to announce the stable release of Wine 6.0 is now available. All right, great, great. And it has been a a, a very large release I should say there are lots of changes uh, so and I would recommend I mean I would recommend if you are using wine to run Windows apps on your Linux machine then I would recommend just upgrade it the problem is you cannot upgrade it through your repository so this is the way you have to do it so as you can see there are so 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 many changes and if you have a higher in graphics card then it you will be you're up for a treat so Let's go for the binary packages for various distributions to this link and once we come to the download you can see it's available for Android, Ubuntu, Debian, Fedora, Mac OS, SUSE, Slackware, FreeBSD and it says Ubuntu 2010 and I am running Pop OS 2010 which is based off of Ubuntu and Debian based so I'll release, I'll uh, enter the command lsb underscore release minus a and you can see that I have Pop OS 2010. Okay, no LSB modules are available for me and the code name is Groovy. All right, so clicking on the link for Ubuntu, we will land on the page where it says there are some instructions that you need to follow. So if you have the Wine HE repository key that was added before 2018 on that date, you need to add the new key. Since I don't have any uh, Wine, I need to install the key. If you are running a previously old version of Ubuntu, then you need to uh, install F audio which is a current dep uh, dependency of wine from OBS so and if you have installed wine from a previous from another repository you need to remove it so and then install this fresh so and if your system is 64 bit like I have I need to enable the 32 bit architecture so I need to enter my password and I've enabled 32 bit architect architecture all right the next step is to in get the key so we'll say wget key, copy this command and paste. So to paste, you have to click on the middle mouse button and it will paste automatically. All right, so we got the key and now we're gonna add the key to our key list. I don't know where, go key list. And then we have to add the repository. So for Ubuntu 2010, this is the link that I'm gonna copy and I'm going to paste. So again, middle mouse button click and then enter. So it, will ask me do you want to enter I say yes add this repository and I'm going to say enter or yes and now my repository has been added now we need to update our system since we have added a new repository we need to fetch we need to fetch all the software which is available in that repository so and so we update sudo apt update and now all all packages are up to date now to install it there are three branches stable branch i for all users general users i would recommend using this stable branch i like to live on the bleeding edge a little bit so i would go with the staging branch and i would not recommend the development branch because the development branch will have bugs which they fix and once it's relatively stable they move it to the staging branch so i'm going to choose st staging but for you guys you can use stable all right so we entered and so many packages are going to be installed so we say 1858 and additional disk space will be used we hit enter and this is getting all the packages from the uh, repository that we added i'm going to be back once I'm going to speed up this video and uh, you can see the packages being uh, yeah. uh, gotten or get it <laughs> by, by our sudo app or by our APT system and we'll be back once our installation is complete.
So yes, guys, almost, and our installation is almost complete, and I am back here to talk to you guys, and once this is complete, we'll see what is the version of Wine we have. All right, almost done. Yes, congratulations. So if we want to check the version of Wine we have, I'm hitting the up arrow again to find the key. I don't want to type today. Okay, okay, Wine version, and I, we have Wine 6.0 staging. Congratulations, guys. If, however, you have a previous version of Wine, let's say Wine 5.0, and you want to upgrade, the process is exactly the same. Thank you so much, guys.